Atticus at school and now I'm in my car because I have just come to Primark. I really wanted to come to Primark and Russian Lakes. That's one place that I haven't been yet when I've been driving. I went up to Bills the other night but not in Primark because I need to go in there. There's a few bits that I need to get for a video that I'm doing pretty soon and then I'm actually going to head over and see my nan which I'm so excited for because I drove over to see my nan the day that I got my car but I haven't driven there by myself yet so I'm actually really excited to do that. So that's what I'm going to do now. I'm going to head into Primark, get the bits I need and then I'll be back and we're going to go see my nan. My nan is the cutest. I just got back or well, I just got to my nan's and she's made me a egg mayonnaise sandwich and given me the tub of Pringles so love life. I haven't had egg mayonnaise in so long. I have made it home. I went to see my nan and it was so lovely. Bless her, she made me that egg sandwich that I showed you and I stayed over there for maybe like an hour and now I'm home. I went and met up with mum for a bit of lunch and now I'm home and I'm going to be editing uh, the video that you're going to be seeing no this is going from tuesday wednesday's video i'm editing um i really like it well i'm saying i really like it i haven't started editing it yet but when i filmed it i was like yeah this is really different um but i feel like it's kind of like eye-opening and i feel like you guys might really like it that is what i'm gonna do and also i bought some stuff from primark as well so once i've edited a bit i'll show you what i got from primark i actually got two things but like i love the things that i got it literally has taken me so i got home at around half 12 it's now quarter past six so i've edited about 15 16 minutes of it and it's taken me like six hours but it's such a good video like honestly i didn't really know about doing this video at first but now i'm like yeah like this is an absolute banger you guys are gonna love it just because it's funny as hell but now i really need to wash my hair because my hair is so greasy and i didn't realize like when i mean it's greasy i mean it is greasy so i'm gonna wash my hair but i want to show you what i got from primark i actually love going to primark so much sorry my balloon oh gosh i'm trying to make a home made tripod with two candles here yeah we succeeded yeah i've got my big five balloon here still it's kind of going down now um but yeah so just gonna leave that float i literally went to primark to go and get like a few certain things for a video and i didn't get those few certain things because i didn't plan it enough what i needed um but i'm gonna sit and plan it tonight and why is my camera flashing two seconds i need to clear some memory card space so the first thing i got like isn't even anything special it's literally a two pack of face wipes I was literally just about to say to you guys, I can't find my face wipes. Oh, oh my god. I caught you in time. Wow, I love my fast reaction time. So let's just stand back up. This morning, I could not find my face wipes anywhere. I desperately needed a face wipe. Literally couldn't find them because basically, I slept in my makeup last night, which I really regret doing because I've come out in some spots, but I was just so tired. I've been filming a video all day and I just literally like collapsed out. Um, and I was going to take my makeup off last night, couldn't find my makeup wipes. This morning, couldn't find my makeup wipes. They're literally just here but never mind i've only got like five or six left in that packet anyway so i was gonna need to buy some but i bought these ones this time they're a pound for a two pack and you get 25 in each i got the it's oil good ones so it's the oil balancing ones because my face is getting a little bit more oily like now it's getting colder you'd think it would happen when it's warmer but no now it's getting colder it's getting oilier and then i just picked up a jumper because when i went to primark with nicole um i don't remember what day we went to primark but we went to primark and on oxford street and at the end nicole pointed out this jumper and i was like oh my god i want that like it's so so beautiful and i literally put a tweet out because i thought it was so funny i used to hate leopard print leopard print cheetah print animal print i just couldn't stand it and now i'm literally like all over it like i genuinely am gonna be in winter looking like a cheetah because i just love it so i got this jumper and it's like a black jumper and then it's got the like i don't know what you call it just like the triangle lines like the the chevron lines one is cheetah print and one is white and i just thought this was so nice and it was only 10 pounds like 10 pounds and this is like fur like this isn't like a cheap material this is actually soft fur and i just loved it like as soon as nicole pointed it out i was like i need to get that so i saw it in my primark this morning and i just knew i had to get it instantly because i was like yeah that is literally a bit of me so i got that and i'm really excited about that and i've got basically i'm going to london on wednesday and thursday because i've got like a, quite a few exciting things we've got like a management kind of like do thing on wednesday and i've got a next event on wednesday then i'm going to instagram hq on thursday so there's like loads that i've got going on this week so i needed to get like a load of new outfits and i've also got a pretty little thing order that's come as well so i will do a haul of that in tomorrow's vlog because i don't have as much to do tomorrow so i'll do it tomorrow but yeah that is basically what i got from primark i'm loving it also i got these the other day i bought them when i went um tesco with amber and then i left them in my car i completely forgot about them but they're the new new cabri joy feels 
milk chocolate things i'm a bit undecided on them like they are really nice but on the front it shows that like the chocolate's going to be like melty inside and like in reality that's just not how it is like the, the chocolate's gone hard but i can imagine if the chocolate was melted these would be insane to be fair i'm saying they're not nice i've nearly had the whole packet so they must be nice i'm gonna try with the few that i've got left i'm gonna try and put them in the microwave to see if it will like melt the chocolate inside literally for a few seconds i'm gonna put them in um and hopefully it will melt it a bit because i really like, like the idea of them they also do um oreo ones and then caramel food ones which i think i'll really like but yeah anyway now i'm gonna get in the bath because i really do need to wash my hair this is really gross but i don't remember the last time that i washed my hair but it's just because i've been having it up recently and like you don't really notice when you have it up um but then the front bit of my hair came down and i was like oh you're looking wet and welcome back to part two of this vlog i fell asleep yesterday after i finished editing i was so tired and i just realized my necklace is like inside my top i was so so tired so i literally had a bath and fell asleep um but this morning it is a brand new day and mum has just gone to drop atticus off at school and then i'm gonna drive down to rushton lakes and i'm gonna meet my mum down there we're gonna go to primark we're gonna go get some lunch um i need to go to jd there's a few different places that i need to go and get stuff from so that's where i'm gonna go now mum literally left the house 25 minutes ago she was like you're not gonna be ready babe i am ready so i'm gonna leave to go to rushton lakes now i do actually need to leave so i will catch up with you guys when i'm there i am officially the worst vlogger i've literally had the busiest morning and you guys will find out why very very soon it's all for a massive main channel 500k video but i just don't want to give any spoilers away so i'm home now i've literally started a breakfast. i just ran from my car i've got a massive pretty little thing order that i'm going to show you guys i've got loads of like winter clothes and like dressy clothes that i want to show you which i'm really excited for and then i guess we'll see what happens to the rest of the day but everything's coming together now and i'm literally so excited i can't wait for you guys to see also the day you're seeing this i have a brand new main channel video up and i love it too so go check it out it is haul time i feel like this vlog is just a bit all over the place and there's just like a lot of hauls in it um i've also done a bit of a primark haul and now i'm gonna do a pretty little thing haul because i have got a lot of clothes to show you and i'm very excited not those ones okay so the first thing that i got i will put pictures on screen as well so you guys can see is this head scarf here and i love hair accessories but i just don't wear them enough so i picked up this and it's got like gold chains it's a little bit like a versace print i feel and i really really like it i don't know how much it was i'm just gonna leave like all the links and everything in the description box but i got this and you were gonna see wearing this so much throughout the winter and autumn like a headscarf is something i wanted for so long and i think it will look so cute when i've got my hair in like a big messy bun or a messy ponytail then i got these flowy black trousers so they've got two pleats at the front and then they flow down and they're just like wide leg trousers they're all black and they've got an elasticated waist again i never normally wear flowy trousers but i really wanted to kind of up my fashion game a bit you know flowy trousers are really in fashion and i just saw these on the website and i thought they were really pretty and just like a basic staple piece to have in your wardrobe so i got those and i really really like them i then got some more trousers so i think it was lissy roddy i saw have these on instagram and she pairs them sort of like white jumpers and black jumpers and they look so cute so i picked up some black and white polka dot trousers they've got a little pocket and again an elasticated waistband and then they are tight fitting i kind of want to get some polka dot flowy trousers i feel like they would be really really nice as well but when i tried them on these were so cute and i'm literally obsessed with them so yeah i really really like these and again yeah just thought it was a nice little staple piece to have in my wardrobe especially because i normally wear like plain trousers and then a dressy top it will be nice to kind of change it around and wear dressy trousers with a plain top and then the other pair of trousers that i picked up are these and again they've got the elasticated waist and they're just like a nudie color and then they've got this black stitched detail i literally am obsessed with it and then it's like a tie belt here so it's attached at the sides so you tie it into the and then you tie it in the front into like a knot and i thought these were really pretty and again they've got like black stitching at the bottom and black stitching down the side i just thought they were something a little bit more than just getting like a basic nudie 
nude pair of leggings i have a really nice top that's black and then it says k by in this exact nude color and they pair together so nicely actually i've got the outfit on in my main channel video so go and have a look it looks really cool then i picked up this pastel blue plain boyfriend t-shirt i love staple pieces like i said and i really needed to get some more plain t-shirts because i just don't have enough plain clothes because i can wear this with literally anything plus like the color is like a powder baby blue and i thought it was so pretty i literally don't own anything this color it's a color that i wouldn't normally wear but i thought this was really really nice and it's just like oversized i think i got mine in a size four I think this is a size four and it's quite oversized so i'd go maybe a size down to what you usually are then i got this orange satin shirt and i am also obsessed with this i have it in white and i wore it to like the sitsy party on the friday i've worn it in a few instagram photos and you can wear it in so many different ways you can like tie it up you can have it down like here so you can just see like a little bit of your boob you can have it all the way done up you can wear it in so many different ways so I thought I'd get the orange one because I thought this orange was so beautiful. Like it's such a striking colour and you will literally stand out in any room when you're wearing this. Love the material. It's like a satiny type material and it's just really, really comfy. Really affordable as well. I think it's £20. And who is it on Instagram? Fashion in Flux did a video like five different ways you can wear a shirt like this. And it's amazing. Like I wouldn't have ordered another one unless I saw her do that video because it made me think, oh my god, yeah, I can wear it in like that many different ways then i picked up this top here and it's like again like the burnt orange type color actually is it inside out yeah it's inside out it's basically a bodysuit actually it's not a top and it's a very very low cut um bodysuit i really like it it shows off a little bit of boobs down the middle so i say this is a bit more of a dressy top but they did this in so many different colors i really want to get one in black as well because i was kind of a bit skeptical i was like i don't want to get a load of this same top if they're not going to fit me and if they don't suit my boobs but i tried them on and my boobs actually look really nice in it so i thought yeah i'm going to get that so really really like it i'm definitely going to order it in more colors and it was only eight pounds as well then i picked up this top here which is basically like a one sleeve off the shoulder black top and it's also ribbed so that adds a little bit of extra detail it makes it look a little bit more expensive than just a plain top and it's really really nice i got mine in a size six i possibly should have got a size eight i think because it is quite tight but tight fitting you know it's not going to fall down at least i know that but it's really really pretty and it was only six pounds so again link will be down below then i picked up this top here and i thought this was so pretty it's such an like an autumnal color autumnal isn't a word but it me and my mum say it it's autumn autumnal i don't know somebody tell me down below it's like a mustardy yellow color it's really really pretty i think the tag's caught up that's why it looks really weird and it's actually like a square neck bodysuit i just thought this was so nice and again it's ribbed and it's just a basic piece to have in your wardrobe and this tag is really annoying me i'm all about those like basic pieces and then dressing them up with like necklaces and stuff and i thought this would be the perfect top to be able to do that because you'll be able to see all like the necklaces that i layer up and then i also got but i don't know where it is oh it's over here it is a plain black oversized boyfriend t-shirt slash dress literally just a big black oversized top and it's got short sleeves and it's like quite wide so it bags down really nicely but it was only 10 pounds and i really really wanted just a plain black dress i saw so many people wear them and again lay them up with the necklaces and it looks so cool and then i also picked up some of these socks here and it's just got like the black pretty little thing logo with like the stitches very similar to gucci i thought it was really funny so i thought i'd get them and that is everything in my haul i literally love everything so much so like i said all the links so it will be down below if you do want to purchase anything oh actually there is one more thing but i think i've got it on as if i said i think i've got it on i have got it on let me show you it's this leopard print bodysuit and i was saying the other day i was like literally leopard print was like not for me like last year i despised it i was like i don't want to be seen in leopard print and this year like i'm i bought a leopard print cohort i'm that obsessed I literally love it so much uh, this leopard print looks a bit more expensive because it's a bit bigger it's not like the small print um, and I just really really like it so I got this as well so that is everything everything will be linked down below if you do want to 
purchase because I love. Okay, so my eyelashes have come off because I'm literally feeling so stressed right now. Tomorrow I have like a fairly big management evening where we're meeting loads of people. I'll basically explain it later, but I don't like my outfit and it is currently, what's the time, at 10 past six and I'm literally in my head, I'm like, do I just run down to Russian Lakes and go and have a quick look around H&M, see if I can find something because honestly, really not feeling the outfit and I just feel like I need to get something else like i ordered something which i'll show you when i get back but i'm not feeling i think i'm just gonna have to run down to russian lakes and literally within 10 minutes i'm down here i'm gonna go to h&m please pray for me that i find something honestly really didn't want to have to make this trip but you know what needs must and i just burped i'm so sorry i really did just walk in the shop looking like this like wow but i did get something from h&m when i get home i'll give a brief explanation this vlog has literally just been all over the place but today has literally been the busiest day of my life and i still have so much to do and it's seven o'clock so i'm gonna head back home now i'm gonna get my stuff done and then i can finally explain to you why this vlog has been so all over the place because i don't even know myself so so i'm just about to pack my suitcase for london and first of all i just got my normal ted baker suitcase out i was like yep yeah, everything will fit i literally went to put byron's birthday presents in the case and they took up half the case already and i also need to fit has his birthday present in here as well because i haven't seen them since they're birthday to give them their birthday present so well I've seen has but it's basically too big but I'm not going to show you what I got them until I'm basically there on a Thursday when I go and drop them off um but yeah so now I've got to take my massive suitcase with me to London so that's fun I finally might be getting somewhere look how packed my case is like honestly it's so heavy I've got has and virus presents in there I've got three event outfits I've got normal outfits I've got photo shoot stuff I've got like three pairs of shoes basically R.I.P. me on the tube because i actually don't know how i'm gonna get this case around london so that's really fun i actually look awful because i've just literally put my hair behind in a bun so i'm so sorry basically i was just so stressed out earlier because i ordered an outfit for tomorrow night's event which is basically we're no longer red hair we're actually called mc sarchi and social or mnc sarchi and social and we have got like a big kind of event where we're meeting everybody from the new team and there's going to be a few celebs there and a lot of people in tv and it's going to be a very very big night and i wanted to look really nice and i ordered a new outfit from pretty little thing i loved it when it came and then i tried it on and i was like you know what like it just doesn't look right like the top that i'm wearing with it really doesn't look right and i was stressing out so i thought you know what no i'm just going to drive down thank god i've got my car i'm just going to go to h&m and i'm going to see if they've got like a different top so i managed to find a different top and now i literally love the outfit i think it's so so nice and i'm actually like really really excited to wear it now so that dilemma was sorted and even though i've got to take my massive case to london which i'm actually dreading um at least that's sorted and at least i feel comfortable in my outfit now and basically tonight i've been planning a video because on a sunday is my big 500k special video and it's a video that's taking a long time a lot of planning um um, you guys will see what I mean when it comes out but honestly like the video that went out tonight on my channel I love I tried the cheapest foods from the supermarket and it was like such a good video so you should definitely go and check that out um, and then obviously I've got my 500k special going up on Sunday so I'm a little bit stressed and then I've also got a video that Byron's going to help me film a little bit for on Thursday night slash Friday which is going to come out next week so I've just been sat writing a plan of all the things that I need to do for it because it's quite complex and I I don't I don't want to get my footage mixed up so I'm trying to like get everything sorted basically YouTube is actually really complex some people think that it's really really easy and you know what it's, it's an amazing job it's the best job in the world but it also is so stressful and so hard like when you want to really get the good content out there which is what I want to do at the moment I don't just want to film constant sit down videos I just don't want to do that anymore I really want to put all the effort in that I can to my videos and hopefully you guys are enjoying it I mean I know for the past month month you guys have been loving the new content and I'm so happy so I'm just trying to keep on my game and you know get everything sorted and do also do Instagram as well do like all the hauls on my insta stories and get new posts up and new makeup looks for you guys but honestly I do feel a little bit better now I've kind of got everything done I don't know why I feel so stressed 
like I really don't know why I feel so stressed I just need to calm down and just take one thing at a time but I just have so much to do other than that that's basically it so now I'm just going to finish packing my case I just need to package Haz's birthday present up because I've actually got to post it to her tomorrow morning before I get the train because it's too big so you guys will see in the vlog when I go around there what it is um but it's way too big it won't even fit in my big suitcase so I need to do that and then I'm going to snuggle up into bed I'm going to have an early night because I've got a really busy day tomorrow and we're going to go to London so pretty buzzing not gonna lie it is now near enough midnight and I've just finished up everything that I needed to do so I'm gonna head straight to bed but thank you so much for watching I hope you guys have enjoyed and I will see you tomorrow at 6 p.m for a brand new vlog Mwah. bye